Welcome back. A new campaign by the Alliance for Women's Health and Prevention is advocating for insurance coverage of comprehensive obesity care. And joining us now is Millicent Gorham, the CEO for the Alliance for Women's Health and Prevention. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for having me, Amber. Yeah, so right now about one in three women in the U.S. are impacted by obesity. And there's some misunderstandings about this. So kind of tell us, break that down for us. Sure. One in three adult women in the United States are living with obesity. 57% of African American women and 44% of Latino women are living with obesity. We know that that impacts their physical health, their social well being, and their financial well being. So we just want to make sure that women get access to comprehensive obesity care. And, you know, a lot of people don't realize it, that there isn't full coverage when you're dealing with that type of a, a disease. And so tell us a little bit about more comprehensive obesity care. What does that include and why is that so important? Comprehensive obesity care is care across the continuum. So we're talking about intensive behavioral therapy, nutritional therapy, physical activity, surgery and anti-obesity medications. And so we want to make sure that women are covered across the continuum. And so right now you all are launching a new campaign called Everybody Covered Campaign. And tell us more about that. We are excited to launch the Everybody Covered Campaign. The campaign is to educate women about obesity and then to empower women to have crucial conversations with their employers and with their elected officials. We just want to make sure that comprehensive obesity care is included in their health benefit package, no different than high blood pressure, diabetes, and we just think that is fair, that obesity as a chronic disease is covered. And talk about some of the treatments that would be needed with coverage from insurance that isn't covered currently. What we're looking to do is to make sure that the coverage that is offered is no different than the other chronic diseases. Obesity cover is directly related to 200 other diseases including high blood pressure, diabetes, osteoarthritis. We just want to make sure that women can get that coverage through their employer's benefits package. Yeah, definitely important. And so what steps will you all be taking now to try to make sure that all the needs are met and covered through insurance? What are your next steps? The next steps for us is to one, have those crucial, have women have those crucial conversations with their elected officials to help the officials to understand better about obesity and what make to making sure that comprehensive care is attended to to make sure that Medicaid beneficiaries can also receive comprehensive care only 16 states now provide comprehensive obesity care we want to make sure that our elected officials at the Congress can also get over the line the treat and obese Treat and Reduce Obesity Act. That's for Medicare beneficiaries. We want to make sure that all women at all stages, ages and stages, are have access to comprehensive obesity care so they can live their best lives. Yeah, absolutely. Millicent, thank you so much for joining us. Real quickly, we're running out of time, but tell us where people can go and learn more information about this. Go to our website at everybodycovered.org. All right, thank you so much for joining us. And Jessica, we'll send it right back over to you.